Some people have been asking me why I have so much Nine Inch Nails music in the background of all my YouTube videos lately. Uh, well yes, I am a huge Nine Inch Nails fan, but that's not the main reason. Most music is released under something called copyright. Well, Nine Inch Nails decided to release Ghosts under something called the Creative Commons. Let me explain the difference. This is copyright. And this is you. And this is what happens when copyright law and you try to interact. Let me give you an example of how copyright law and normal people interact. Today is my birthday. I would love to make a video of people singing happy birthday to me. But I can't because Time Warner won't let me. Time Warner believes that one cannot sing happy birthday to you lyrics for profit without paying extremely high royalties. These royalties are 10,000 US dollars. That's right, $10,000 to sing happy freaking birthday. This includes any use in film, television, radio, anywhere open to the public or even among a group where a substantial number of those in attendance are not friends or family members. Have you ever sung that song in a situation where you weren't surrounded by family members? Say at an office party? Well, guess what? You're guilty of copyright infringement. Have fun going to court. The Creative Commons, on the other hand, is not at all like copyright. Instead of getting sued for just about everything, the Creative Commons lets you do all sorts of awesome things. When you release something under the Creative Commons, you get to decide how people get to use your work. For example, I can determine whether or not you are allowed to use this video for commercial purposes, which you are not. However, I would allow you to modify it all you want and release it and do whatever the hell you want with it, so long as you release your modifications under the same license that mine is released under. This is called the share-alike non-commercial license, but you don't have to release your material under the same conditions. You can decide exactly what what rights you want your users to have and what rights you want to maintain for you alone. In short, making your own music is a lot of work and takes a lot of time. Using someone else's is very easy and if you're not going to get sued for it, that's good. So I'm using Nine Inch Nails music because it's awesome and I don't get sued and that's a good thing.